Welcome to another video, my name's Jasper and today we're going to be covering how to animate underlines on hover. So the first thing we need to do is get a div block in there and we're also going to want to set it so it's in line and we'll call this div block animated lines hover. There we go, nice and simple. And then what we're also going to do is we're going to set it so nothing can go outside of it. Now we're going to want to add a link. So we'll chuck that in there. Let's make it white so we can see it. We'll get rid of the underline that it already has. And then the next thing we need to do is get another div block. And then we're going to make that two pixels. We're going to make that white as well. And as you see, we have a nice little underline there. Now what we want to do is make sure that we can't see it when somebody first comes onto the website. So we'll give it negative 100%. There we go. It's now gone. And now what we need to do is we're going to need to add some animations. But first, actually, let's give this div block a name. So it's already called animated lines on hover that's not the one that we want so what we want to do is go to the new div block here and we'll call this animated underline nice and simple now let's go back to our link and we're going to add animations here so let's go mouse hover <coughs> select a new animation and then we're going to go new and then we're going to, oh, we actually first we will go move. I was wrong. Bear with me, people. Okay, now we're going to go move. Okay, and then what we want to do is have it set as position first as negative 100%. And then we're going to add another move, make it zero. So it goes back to its position and we turn that up to out. Okay, so let's have a quick look at what we've done here. As you see, it will now come outwards, but it's not going away. So what we need to do is add a new animation. So we're going to go start animation. We're then going to select our animation again. Sorry, I jumped the gun. There we go. We add our new animation. And this time, we want it to go away. So a negative 100%. And then we make this out as well. And there we have it, that should work. Let's have a look. And there you go, just that easy. We now have an animated underline on any link that you need or text. Thanks for watching this video and look forward to seeing you in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe as well to stay up to date with any other videos that I'll be releasing. Thanks.